So this is the door in to the right. Uh, that's under my stairs. My table saw, flat stock, some failed segmenting projects. To the left, uh, there's my drum sander. Uh, my scraps. Clamps, one of my workbenches. Cabinets. Mostly finishes in this one. The other one's mostly junk. Various jigs, angle jigs, uh, a little sander. Over here, there's my hollowing arm. My sharpening station. Underneath is a microwave for drying bowl blanks on a stereo. And underneath this side, there's a tool toolbox with various tools in it. Uh, my coring systems under there, a slide vise, and here is the actual lathe station. My tools behind it. Some shower curtains that I uh, I pull one from that direction and one from this direction, and it keeps the shavings all around close to the lathe for easy cleanup. Uh, my dust collection system is plumbed out to my garage. That goes out to my garage where the actual dust collector unit sits. Uh, under my lathe, I built this cabinet. That There's two drawers. Uh, this has mostly boring bars and hollowing tools. Uh, there's some tool rests miscellaneous centers in there most of my centers and stuff are on this little tool rack um, there's also about 500 pounds of concrete under the drawers for ballast and then on the other side on this wall this plugs into my table saw when I wheel my table saw out here the only thing I use my table saw for is segmenting though uh, here's another workbench. This table folds up. If I need uh, more workbench area, I can fold that up. There's a shelf underneath there also with tools on it. Uh, shelf above here. Some stuff from my daughter. Some bandsaw blades. My drill press. And my bandsaw. It's on wheels also so I can wheel it out. And that's it. My whole shop is eight and a half, uh, eight and a, eight and a half feet this way, and eleven feet this way, and then this little storage area underneath my stairs, and that is my whole shop. So there's my table saw that I wheel out when I do segmenting.